Mr Arnott now. This debate highlights the crossroads that the British people find themselves at. Because in any society there is a balance to be found on tax and on transparency. On the one hand, we could publish every detail of every person's earnings and every tax return. We could say, if you've done nothing wrong, you've got nothing to hide. It would be transparent, but it would provide no privacy. After all, you could allow phone tapping, you could allow looking into anyone's internet history or even ban curtains using that logic. But on the other hand, we could do the complete opposite. We could respect everybody's privacy and yet publish absolutely nothing and allow uh, things to not be exposed, which should be. That would make it difficult to deal with uh, tax evasion and to deal with aggressive tax avoidance. It would make it harder to ensure that multinationals don't have a competitive advantage over SMEs. But here's the point. If on June the 23rd the United Kingdom votes to leave the European Union, we'll have the sovereign right to take these decisions for ourselves. Get the balance right to ensure that justice and privacy are properly and proportionately balanced. But if the UK votes to stay in, these decisions will continue to be taken remotely in Brussels and Strasbourg. So it's a fundamental choice here. Who governs Britain? Is it this place or is it Westminster? 